Hey guys, it's Corey Beasley with Fight Camp Conditioning. Today we're going to talk about using complexes to develop more endurance in our athletes. So guys, complexes are basically just stringing together compound movements without, without rest, right? So we might be doing, you know, a kettlebell snatch, a front squat, and then maybe a row or some, something along those lines. What we're going to do is I want to show you and walk you through um, a handful that I've used with the boys over the years, but I need you to understand a couple things real quick. We can spin these complexes a lot of different ways. Now that might depend on the goal of the athlete, the ability level of that athlete, and what, what equipment we have access to. But the idea is just basically cramming a lot of work into a short period of time and stimulating the body from a lot of different angles in different ways that we might not typically get with traditional strength work. All right, guys, this first complex I'm going to show you is with the Renegade Bars from Pure Motion. Really similar to a, uh, a landmine setup, so if you don't have access to Renegade Bars, you can use a landmine setup as well and just kind of customize it for you. But basically what we're going to do is we're going to do a, uh, a clean. We're going to do five cleans. We're going to do five overhead presses. And then we're going to do five drop step lunges. Okay, we're going to do all those in succession. So basically it looks something like this. All right, guys, this next complex is with Josh Hankins sandbags. We call the ultimate sandbag system. Um, but uh, Josh did a really, really great job um, designing these bags. But basically what we're going to do is, again, we're just going to run through a handful of exercises. The first one's going to be a rotational lunge, which is unique um, to these bags and Josh's system. Um, and then we're going to move into a squat pattern and then a rowing pattern. Um, again, just sequencing big complex movements together to stimulate the body in a variety of different ways stringing them all together so it taxes not only our strength but our ability to endure over time. So let's go through it. First one is just a rotational lunge. Rotating outside that front leg, staying real tall. Then we'll hinge, go into a more of a rowing pattern. Finish with just a regular front squat. All right, guys, this last one is a kettlebell complex. So, kettlebells are pretty prevalent. You guys probably have access to those, but we're going to go through a uh, basically a pressing pattern or a push press, and we're going to do a front loaded drop step or back step lunge, and then we're gonna finish with swings, okay? Five reps of each. Go. So guys, those are just some examples, you know, to get your brain turning, right? Complexes, again, they're a great way to develop strength and endurance and tax ourselves in some new ways by using those compound movements and stringing them all together. But there are a few things you need to understand. More repetitions, more exercises, it's going to be a hell of a lot more taxing. It's not wrong, but depending on the ability level and the goal of that athlete, 
you need to adjust some of those things. So if you guys got any questions or comments or anything like that, leave them down below. And as always, hit that subscribe button up above so you can stay in touch with us and keep up to date with all the new stuff we're putting out.